first tonight at five, a Georgia high school football coach behind bars accused of murder. Good evening and thanks for being with us. I'm Jennifer Bellamy and I'm Faith Jesse. So police in Maryland say that the coach confessed to killing his girlfriend and then turned himself in. 11 Alive's Tracy A. McPeer joining us live from Spalding County with what we know tonight, Tracy. Well, coach Carl Carney has been a football coach since 2020 here at Spalding High School. His former students tell me he was a mentor, so they're devastated to hear that according to Maryland police, he's confessed to strangling his girlfriend. At first, I didn't believe it. I thought people were playing because it was just such a shocker to me. Camry Johnson was a football manager for three years at Spalding High School. She says news that her former teacher and football coach was arrested and charged with murder does not make sense. Because of the person I know he is, I just couldn't see him, you know, in that situation. According to police in St. George's County, Maryland, 43 year old Carl Kearney Jr. of Griffin, Georgia, walked into their police station Saturday morning. Kearney advised them that he had strangled his girlfriend, 38 year old Petrina Best, inside of this Maryland home earlier that morning. Police searched the home and found Best's body inside. 11 Alive confirmed through our sister station, WUSA, that the home belongs to Best's parents. Our sister station also confirmed that public records in Maryland show that Best attended Georgia Southern University and worked as a traveling nurse. Larikbia McCord's son played football for Kearney at Spalding High School for three years. She says she's shocked that this happened, but she is not surprised he confessed. He's just been a, a stand up guy. And even with this situation taking place, I still see him as a stand up guy for turning himself in. He's showing them accountability and be responsible for your actions. Now, Coach Kearney is charged with first and second degree murder and is being held in Maryland. We reached out to the school district repeatedly for a statement and some details on Kearney's employment, but they're on winter break and they did not respond. Back to you. All right, Tracy, thank you.